Hi guys, Squire here, and today I'm going to be having a look at the different graphic presets for Warhammer Total War and compare the difference both in terms of visual fidelity and also performance. So before we do the in-game comparison, let's take a quick look at the difference in options between the different presets. When set to Ultra, the game maximizes all of the settings, SSAO and distortion effects are enabled, anti-aliasing is set to MLAA, which is the lowest setting, and curiously, depth of field and screen space reflections are disabled on Ultra. Also, one last thing I noticed is that the unit size is not on the higher setting either. Moving on to the high preset, all of the detail settings are lowered to high except for textures which stay at ultra. In fact, on every one of the presets, textures are the only setting that remains on the ultra setting even on the lowest preset. Anti-aliasing is turned off completely, anti-stropic filtering is reduced to 8, the unit size remains at large and SSAO is disabled. For medium, the detail settings and unit size are changed to medium. Distortion is disabled and anti-stropic filtering is reduced to 4. Lastly, the low preset. Unit size and detail settings are set to low. Shadows are disabled and texture filtering is reduced to trilinear, which I probably just pronounced wrong. Also, the porthole quality is reduced to 2D. Now, without further ado, I will replace my dulcet tones with something a bit more relaxing and show you how these different settings affect the game visually and from a performance standpoint. Mm -hmm. 